Good morning and welcome to another episode of the Jolly EV Fans. Today we're off to Western Supermare the night. I found out I had um, two days off and so I messaged Peter last night from work saying I've got two days off, what we're going to do? Do you fancy going away somewhere for the night? And here we are. Off to sunny Western. I've never been. You've been, haven't you? Yes, but as a child. Um, it's worth having a, an adventure too. One of the advantages of owning an EV that people don't consider is the fact that because it's next to nothing in fuel costs, it allows you to have these little adventures. We charged up to 100%. We're going to drive down to uh, Western, spend the day down in Western, and then uh, come out of Western to a Days Inn hotel, which has an ecotricity outside, and charge there for, th for the night, explore the area again the next day, top up, and then come home. We should be able to get down there in a one We should, we definitely could if we take the Zoe but the leaf's a little bit bigger and a bit more, com well, a lot more comfortable. So we, uh, we're we going to poodle on down there, get the most out of the battery and uh, take advantage of the th free event of the day's in. <laughs> Dude, that makes it even cheaper, so it can go on. You can and plus it's um, eat out to help out, so we'll be getting half price meal tonight somewhere, mm -hmm. or today. Well, I put into the sat nav. There's a Toby Carvery about at the halfway point, just past, just about Mid Bristol. So we'll uh, briefly stop there, get something to eat. We may top up because I don't mind paying for the electricity. It's not that expensive. It also gives us a chance to check to see if our Polar cards are still working. <laughs> yeah. The Polar cards were a freebie when uh, Deb's was in her last place. She, her electricity provider also provide you with Polar cards. Now they meant to stop at a certain point and we have mentioned it to Paula and the person we spoke to turned around and said well when it stops it stops don't worry about it so we don't feel guilty we'll go down and we'll um, we'll see if they still work. Of course you have to pay for the electricity with the Polar cards but it's like 15 pence a kilowatt as opposed to Ecotricity which is 30 or 35. Right then, next stop, Toby Carvery. Doesn't matter what type of vehicle you're driving, whether it's an EV, a petrol, diesel, whatever, traffic is still traffic. Yes. <laughs> and uh, you tend to get stuck into it, especially this time of day on, on the road into Swindon. Yeah, but at least we're not polluting. Yeah. And we're not we're not actually using any of our fuel when we when we sat here. We're in a convoy. Doom, 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 doom. How? <laughs> Just don't notice there's another leaf behind us. <laughs> so we need John and Jared to come and sing in the convoy. years old yeah and you know they only last 18 months the batteries yeah they're useless after a couple of years so it's had a couple of new batteries maybe he's put a diesel in there ah like a range extender but yeah yeah
Just about up in front of us there is an Ampera E, a very rare beast. Oh, so the, the one that's pulled in front of you? The black one, yeah. yeah. Very, very rare. They are like hen's teeth. Vauxhall's original electric car in this country. There it is in front of us. Is it full electric? Full electric, very, very nice EV. At least I think it's full electric, fairly certain it is. Certainly, at the very least, an hybrid. Oh, well, I can't see any tailpipes. It's like the equivalent of the uh, the Bolt in the States. Right. But it just didn't support it in this country. Right. I can't remember the distances, but I seem to remember reading just or seeing an article on the news about somebody that used to drive like 70, 80 miles every day, every this couple every single day to have chips on that pier. Right. That was their thing. Got to come. Yes, I'm glad you brought me roller skates. When it, this evening, I think I'll play. Like. The pavilion. Oh, the pavi garden's pavilion. Considering it's a Wednesday afternoon in August and it's been pretty dull, maybe it's got people, it's been dull the last couple of days that they're coming out today. where I got my idea from. She stayed at the Royal. Oh, it's the Royal Grove now. Might not be, might be different. Rooms from £32.50. Living the dream. Away. You can smell donuts. We would go down there, but uh, flight Brighton, no dogs. Well, it's understandable. But unlike Brighton, dogs are allowed on the beach on the north side. Are you 
not being given anything. Oh, Aww. poor puppy dog. And none of those chips. You want some fish? I know. Yes. Yeah, I think we'll. I think we'll start coming here more often. Because it would fit, even in winter, it would fit our needs. Release the puppy dog! Maybe we can tie maybe we can tie two together to cover it. You're gonna be You're gonna dig? You're gonna do some digging. Do you know oh you're just gonna wee on it, okay. You bu you building a moat? Course, as he ran in the golf courses and it's zooming around it. But I couldn't get it back. No, I had no control. I
numbers. Oh crap, that? Huge plane. It's um Galaxy. Or one of those Euro things. Might be a Euro thing. No, it could be a, it could be a normal airline and actually going to Bristol and all. Oh, might be. Yes. We're so used to seeing um... gliders. <laughs> gliders. Well, we are. We see a couple of gliders from Bristol. Nah, that looks like a galaxy. It does, doesn't it? I can't see it now. It's in the sky. Your head's sorry, in the I'm way. Not... Your head's in the way. I'm sorry. I tend to keep it there. In the way. How would you touch your head? Cool. Hello, girls. Agree with. They are more expensive than petrol cars. Now, there's no reason for them to be more expensive. It's just manufacturers holding the market them. Yeah. If they can make them for 11, 12,000 pounds in China, little 40, 50 kilowatt hour EVs, why can't we do this? Do it in this country. Yeah, but then you've got imports, you know, costs. Where's this car come from? Where's the MG come from? Well, wasn't the um... Where's the Jaguar come from? Wasn't this made in Newcastle? Uh, oh, Washington. Yes, this one, yeah, true. Sorry. Sunset looking good in the camera. I really can't see. So darling, do how do you feel about coming out of retirement? Coming out of retirement? Yeah. I have re 1986 Speed Skater of the Year. It's actually 87. 87, okay. Come on, Evie. Come, <laughs> come on, Evie. Fetch Evie. your ball. Fetch. Evie, get your, get your ball. There. <laughs> Do you think you can uh, re regain your records? No. <laughs> no. Muscle and memory. Do you, know, do you know, and to think I was on blade, two millimetres thick. It'll all come rushing back. <laughs> As I fall. Muscle memory, I'm telling you, it's... it's... Really? Yes.
That's it. Aim for the bins. Yeah, don't worry, we can go back and get them. <laughs> many a year. <laughs> One for the family album, isn't it? Oh, yeah. Absolutely. Come on, muscle memory, kick in. <laughs> no. Just in your mind, it's 1986. <laughs> You've got leg warmers on. <laughs> and bros are in the charts. <laughs> Ben. <laughs> oh no, that's Sam. <laughs> when will I, will I be famous? Soon as I upload, as soon as I upload now. When, when? It's coming back to you, isn't it? Slowly. I'll go and get your shoes. Don't fall over unless I got the camera on you. Oh. <laughs> You've never been to the gorge before. when it's dry but then it'll be really busy won't it? Yeah. Oh my gosh. It's so pretty and dramatic. It's gorgeous. Oh, I'd see what you did there. Rubbish. commercialised but well why not Wonder what form did. Imagine it would have been, yeah, a lot of water and stuff, wouldn't it?
come back one day and walk it. Well, that um, three mile loop sounded quite nice. Mm. I think it'd be tiring getting up, up here, but not impossible. I think it's so worth it. in another part of the country it wouldn't be considered so much but this is a fairly placid gentle landscape so yes 